story, story about our friend Alice who visited Wonderland. Wonderland? What kind of place could that be? Alice in Wonderland One day, Alice and her sister were sitting under a shady tree. They were reading books. Oh, I'm so bored. Isn't there anything fun to do? At that moment, a rabbit ran by quickly. He was looking at his watch. Oh, oh, I'm late. I'm very, very late. Oh. Mr. Rabbit, why are you in such a hurry? Alice was puzzled by the rabbit. She, fo she followed him and asked him where he was going. But the rabbit pretended that he couldn't hear her. He hurried down into his hole. Alice thought for a while at the entrance. She decided to follow the rabbit down the hole. Alice tumbled down, down, down. It was as if the hole was pulling on her. <coughs> at last, Alice landed at the bottom. She opened her eyes and saw the rabbit going through a tiny door. Through that tiny door. At that moment, a small bottle on the floor spoke to her. Drink me. Alice drank the juice in the bottle. Then she became as small as the bottle. Oh dear! What has happened to me? <laughs> Alice was shocked and cried loudly. Alice couldn't stop crying. Her tears ran down like a river. She climbed inside the bottle so she wouldn't drown. The bottle floated around like a boat. The bottle was floating along for a long time. It took her to a strange forest. When she climbed out of the bottle, she met many animals. Then the rabbit suddenly appeared again. Oh, I'm in big trouble. The queen has asked me to bring her the gloves and the fan. Oh. Hello again, Mr. Rabbit. Oh, I'm busy here, very busy. I have to hurry to the cottage. Oh. The rabbit was busy. So Alice offered to carry the gloves and the fan for him. However, the gloves and fan were nowhere to be found. All she could see were some candies on a plate. What are these candies doing here? Should I try one? Alice ate the candy. She grew taller than the cottage. Oh, my look at Alice! 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 Hey, everybody! It's just me, Alice! The rabbit and the other animals were very frightened. They threw cookies at Alice. She ate the cookies and became tiny again. The rabbit had already disappeared. Alice finally got out of the forest. She met a brown rabbit and a sleepy head mouse. She also met a wizard who was drinking tea. Have you seen a rabbit carrying a watch? I'll tell you, but first sit down over here and have some tea and cookies. Alice was very hungry. She sat down to drink tea and eat some cookies. However, there was nothing on the plate or in the cup. Alice told the wizard that there was nothing there, but the wizard didn't pay any attention to her. Hmm, 
You are trying to trick me. I think I'll go and find the rabbit myself. Alice didn't understand what was going on, so she left. Alice walked for a while. She met some card soldiers. They were working in the rose garden. What are you doing? What shall we do? The queen hates white roses, so we are painting them red before she sees them. It seems that the queen has a bad temper. The queen finally entered the rose garden. She asked Alice to play cricket with her. Well, you have to hit the porcupine with this flamingo. The one who scores the most wins. Oh, I can't play such a strange game. What? How dare you refuse my order? Soldiers! Grab that girl and bring her to me! Alice was in trouble. All the soldiers were after her. No! No! Help! Help! Oh! No! 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 Alice! Alice, wake up! must have been dreaming. It seems that Alice fell asleep while she was reading. She woke up rubbing her eyes. Then she went home with her sister. Ah! Those amazing adventures were only a dream! I wish I could have a dream about Wonderland tonight.